why do I own so many keyboards? Do you really need these many keyboards? No, not, not really. I don't know, I think it's cool, right? No? Well, I didn't really get into keyboards until this year. Um, When I first started, I thought it was stupid, just watching videos and, oh, this is so dumb, I don't get it. I really don't get it. And then I got my first one, kind of a cheap one. And then I really started getting into it. Like, oh, this is kind of stupid. I probably wouldn't buy any more keyboards after this. Ooh. Uh, then I kept building and getting more signed profiles. Now, does it make you a better gamer? Does it make you go crazy? Does, does it enhance your gameplay? <laughs> well. No, but kinda. No, but kinda. It kinda depends on the size you get. 400%. A TKL, 75%, 65% or 60%. Or if you want to game on a numpad only, then go ahead. But other than that, I don't really see a benefit unless you're into kind of sound or something that looks nice. I really like the feel and how it looks on a desk. And that's just, that's just really about it. <laughs> I know it seems very obsessive, but even then keyboards are getting a lot cheaper. Very, very cheap. Um, you're starting to see budget builds where the keyboards before would cost up to $300, $400 just to even like fully build. Now you're getting metal keyboards for 150, 120, or even $100. I saw a 75% full CNC aluminum being sold. These keyboards I have here are enough for me, but what I find about the keyboards that's so fun is just building it. Building keyboards for people, for clients, for my brothers, for my friends. It's just so fun. Like one of these keyboards here. This is kind of a birthday present slash Christmas gift keyboard that I'm going to give to my brother. Hopefully he doesn't find this video before he gets it, but I think it looks so nice to have a keyboard, like a piece, like an art piece on your desk that complements everything. That looks so aesthetic. I want something that when I walk into the room that gives me comfort or something in the room that kind of catches my eye, especially since I spend a lot of my times on computers, editing, not really, gaming, or just doing something around my PC, whether if I want to work for home or not, I always look at my keyboard and just have it there. And also it has a nice sound profile that's catered towards me. Um, and if you guys want to check out how I built these keyboards, I kind of have to get more in depth into the keyboard building scene, or you want to do a commission for a keyboard build if you want to ask me or anything like that, you know, um, I have my Twitter, hit me in the DMs if you want to, you know, ask me more questions about keyboards or anything like that, or uh, go to my second channel. Uh, this is Plank, where I have my second channel, where I want to do more keyboard stuff because it, it's just fun to build. I really love building and getting into it and just finding out different types of switches and understanding how everything works inside keyboards. I've always loved tinkering around things, so this is kind of like a perfect hobby. This is this is just a fun little one-off thing that I just wanted to bring up. Just having all these keyboards, it doesn't have a benefit for you. <laughs> That's for sure. Yeah, appreciate you and hope you see you on my second channel or third channel, rather. Fourth? Fourth channel. This is, yeah. I, I hope to see you on my fourth channel. <laughs> All right. Bye.